Good evening and welcome to the Silver Lake Stadium for Solent Sports News' coverage of the Hampshire FA Senior Cup final between Basingstoke Town and Haven and Waterlooville. On pitch side, the sports journalist Jack Atkins. Good it's evening, It's an absolute Jack. pleasure. Hopefully the weather holds up and we'll be in for a delightful evening. Um, just tell me a little bit about this competition and why is it important for the two teams? After a relegation, new recruits and a change in coaching, the Solent women's rugby team are just about ready to embark on a new season. And I'm joined live in the studio with the current captain, Ellie Osborne. So Ellie, where did things go wrong for you last season? Again, from a corner, Yates' shot was saved by Scott Louch, but only for home debutant Sean Hobson to score in the rebound. However, Hartlepool were not finished and mounted some pressure on the home side after Nick Kabamba headed in the team's second. But Eastley held on and claimed a 3-2 victory over Hartlepool, putting them in seventh and in contention for the playoffs, whilst Hartlepool sit in 13th. And that is half-time and it is one all, haven't Waterlooville and Basingstoke Town here in the Senior Cup final. And uh, Jack, it was an eventful start to the game. Oh, it was indeed. The Solent men's hockey team are looking to bounce back after a defeat in the Bucks League. The successful side have made many new insertions to the team since October 2018 and are hoping that the new faces shine for the side. But just how are they preparing to do that? Southampton City is known for its maritime history. For example, the Titanic, which left Southampton, but never made it back. So what does that mean? Things or people that leave Southampton don't do very well? Well, this leads me to Ronald Koeman, who was earlier this week sacked by Everton. Now, we are in the town of Southampton, so I want to know what do the people think about this? And finally, Britain's tennis number one has won his first ever ATP title of his career. Kyle Edmonds beat Gail Monfils of France 3-6, 7-6, 7-6 at the European Open final in Antwerp on Sunday. Edmonds, who will rise to a career-high 14th in the world, lost a set in the tournament for the first time, but maintained his composure for the victory. That's all we have time for, and we will be back next Monday for more of the biggest sporting news. As always, thank you for watching, and don't forget to follow our social media pages.